What's going on guys? Welcome back. Today we're gonna to be playing a new game. Called the Back Rooms. Lost tape. Pretty excited for this one. Uh if you know the back rooms, technically what happens is it always seems to happen to people with video cameras. They end up glitching in reality, falling through the ground to the back rooms. And uh, here we go. We want to start tape number one. The tape of Josh. Here we go. Hopefully you can see everything pretty good. All right, hey boss. As you can see, the um, the people were able to clean up the place, and I was able to help. Really, um, really good. Uh, that one spot that was really bad. Uh, I don't. That, that may be an exception, but uh, everything else is clean. Um, as you can see right here, I'm moving around here a little bit to show you. And uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Um, but I'll go to room one soon. Yeah, man, it's pretty good, man. I just wanted to let you know. All right, dude. Yeah, man, it's pretty good. God dang it. Anyway, yeah, it's Stupid pretty clean over here, dude. Morning. It's pretty good. Air hey, back room down. What? Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, there he goes. Fell to the floor. Here we are. Last tape. Yeah. <laughs> Super scared. I am super duper scared. Why is everything so Where? tiny? Hello? Anyone here? Hello? Maybe it's supposed to resemble he's holding the camera. Because, yeah, it's a very small. Why do I have that on? It always does that. Uh, excuse me. Full screen. 2060, enable the V-Sync, put on Epic, okay, oh, we're good, maybe I need to restart, <laughs> I don't know, I think we're good, eat, jeez, you, Okay, when you start walking, it's very slow. I am going to use this notepad to make some annotations of some possible clues about how to escape from this place. Why don't you do that, man? Can I like squeeze to that? Oh, I have a flashlight. <clears throat> okay. Uh, that's not the right way. I always seem to get lost in these games. This is a big giant maze, after all. What is that? I see a trail of something. Uh, no, that's a mannequin. <laughs> you scared the crap out of me. I thought you were some kind of monster. What is this a blank page of? Okay. Massive parking garage with columns everywhere made to destroy your vehicle. It'd be like an obstacle course in here for your car. It'd be kind of fun, honestly. 
Okay, what? Nothing back here. Okay. Sweet. A first aid kit. Guess I don't need it. Anyway, uh, guys, we got chair number one. Call this chair the bar stool. You set it in your bar and you drink while you sit on it. This is the second type of bar stool. Chair number two. In this type of chair, you're welcome to lean back and hold your feet on the ledge. Well, I guess you can hold your feet on the ledge on the first one, but you can put your back against the thing. Whatever it's called. I don't even know what this is. The back. The seat of the back. I don't fucking know. Anyway. Chair number three. This is a good old office chair. Or student desk chair. These chairs are extremely uncomfortable. <laughs> Alright, let's move on. Hey. Well, I don't mind if I yes, please. What we got in here? Okay. So we got static. What is this, a hole for a mouse? What is this? Is this why? What? Why are we? Why is this place growing mushrooms? What is happening? Excuse me. I saw this door open one time when the lights were red. So I gotta run back to that door when the light's red? Okay. Oh no. Arrow going this way. What's that in the middle of the thing? What's this? That is... That's kind of awkward and strange. As in, I'm pretty awkward. Alright, now we're taking a... So, we're not going that way. We're going this way? Okay. I'm just following the arrows. Just kind of following the arrows. I'm gonna run around with a chicken, like a chicken with his head cut off. What's that? Deja vu area. This is your first time here. If this area feels familiar, immediately alert foundation staff. You see something? Say something. Okay. There's an arrow. God, did I do that? I didn't know I could make him say that. Is anyone here? I don't think anyone's here. I don't think it's any... I don't think it's worth saying anything. 
Well, that's a dead end. Okay. This way? Aha! I see a factory. What the heck is this? The password to access this computer is scattered all around this place. I was able to find the first number, which is nine. I hope this helps if, you, if I, I hope this helps you if I can't escape. The first number is nine. Telling me I gotta go all around the back rooms to search for a password key. Are you serious? But I don't want to do that. <laughs> Fine. I guess we'll go searching around this. Wait a minute. Maybe I don't have to go searching. I don't know what I'm supposed to My name is Jennifer, scientist and lead researcher at SCP. I'm recording this message to record the success in the task of shutting down the generator at this location, allowing that metal door to open. The problem is, apparently this brought something from another dimension. I created a password so that the generator doesn't turn off by accident. When deciding to enter the password to be able to access another dimension, whatever it is, be prepared to run for your life. Oh, what was that? Be prepared to run for my life. Enter the password. The, the, the first number is nine. Oh. Where do I find the other passwords? Are they written on walls? Are they written on the floor? I guess I just follow the thing back to its thing. The arrows. Seven. This was my house for a long time. Uh, here. Uh, this was my house for a long time here in this place. I hope you make a good use of it now. Are you dead, my friend? Did you die? Nine, and then, what is that? One, there's one, two, three, four, five, there's six freaking numbers? Okay, well, I need my phone so I can write this down. I'm not going to remember what that seven is. Number seven, sad. Yes, that is very sad. There's a table right there. How do we get over there? To the table. We got this way. We got some more arrows. More arrows. I'm always fond of that. Red light. Ever dream this man? No. I've never dreamed that guy before. Kinda looks creepy. Why would I ever want to dream him? What do we got here? A door to nowhere? Uh, a fake door?
Do we have concerts here? Hello? Hello? Anybody here? That's, um, there's probably nothing down there. Eight. Okay. Found another one. Nine eight blank seven blank blank. Nine eight blank seven blank blank. Okay, that makes sense. I hope that monster doesn't chase me when I'm trying to gather gather the codes. chairs would they? I don't think so. What's at the end of this hallway? Darkness. Darkness is spooky. Okay, we're good now. We're out of the darkness. What's down here? I see another door. Does that look like? Oh! Oh my God! A door scared the shit out of me, guys. <laughs> okay, Brett. Scared of a little door. And I zoomed in by accident. Okay, I don't think I go there. We're gonna go this way. There we go. There's a spooking chair just sitting here. But nothing there. Where's that table I see? No table? How do I get to that table? That's definitely not an area I want to go to. Ah, oh, here we go. This place brings some memories. Okay, cool, but what about a code? What about a code? I need code. Oh, here we go. Arrow. Yeah, I need to get back there. Hmm. What was that? Is that my shadow? That was a scary shadow. Kind of made me jump a little bit on the inside. Alright, uh, where the hell is this code at? Oh, here we go. Here's something. It's not a code. Okay. We're just going to be running around in circles until we find codes. But I'm getting a little warm, so I'm going to roll my sleeves. The scary door. 
Oh, here's another scary door. I mean, never mind. I thought it was a door, and it's just half a wall. Or pieces of a wall. Okay, do I go this way for anything? Do I need to go this way for anything? I see this ba little basket still here. Me running out of stamina has fucking definitely scared me. Okay. Listen, running around trying to look for codes is kind of annoying. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Kind of annoying. Yeah, it's like there ain't even nothing over there. What's the point going over there? This right here, they have nothing on it. What's the point of that? Like this right here, boring as shit to me. I find this extremely boring. Eight two seven three eight four. Eight two seven three eight four. That even it? Did that do it? I thought the first number was nine, though. Isn't that what he said? That's what I got. Yeah, eight two seven three eight four. That's weird. Why is everything blue? That's weird. I hear a monster. I don't like that sound. Uh, I thought it was safe. I thought it was safe. This is spooky, man. With all the blue lights. Just don't scream and be like, hey, anybody here? Hopefully, you he can't hear me. I'm getting kind of hot just thinking about him. My body's sweating already. I gotta get back to that room. Hopefully I'm going the right way. I'm scared. Am I safe though? Duh. Duh. <gasps> oh my god. Uh, yeah. <gasps> okay, we're good now. Pretty sure this was the way to go. No, I just want to crouch. Safe. Well, would you look at that? Rar. Rar. Hi. No. Don't do stuff like that, please. I'm already sweaty. I don't need more sweatiness. 
What? Uh, lockers. Hey, at least I don't have to hide in a locker. Can I jump in the water? No, it don't look like he can jump in the water. Okay. An elevator. Elevator. Get in. This is a very skinny ass elevator. Okay, you know, I don't, somehow I don't feel so safe anymore. <sighs> Is someone gonna chase me? This feels like a chasing, like a hall about, someone's about to chase me and they have to run the opposite direction. No? Is it the infinite sewer hallway? The infinite hallway of sewer. Okay. So far it's starting to seem never ending. I mean I've gotten pretty far. I mean, look at that. Okay, so there is an end. Oh my god. What's with little noises that scare me? Why are we red here? Did I run to the danger side? Hello. This is nice. Am I up in the sky? Interesting. Even more interesting. <laughs> what is this? Where am I at? What the hell? What is this, a ginormous fucking skyscraper or something? And we've reached the no civilization floor? And what is it with these triangle elevators? Well, it's a good thing you can't accidentally fall. <laughs> well, that's weird. Where am I? Honestly. <laughs> I've said that like four times. Where am I? I must be dreaming. You must be dreaming. Hey, you see that over there? You see some black stuff? What is that? <coughs> ah, excuse me. Sorry. Man.
This, uh, this can't be heaven. This place is so calm. Calm and it's got lots of water. For some reason. Where does water come from? Did it rain here? I don't know if I'd want to be here. I mean, as, as peaceful as it is, being alone would suck. You know, I'm not, I would not be interested in being alone. I mean, where all this shit come from? Is that the question? Someone else was here, obviously. What'd they do, bring paintings into the back room? Oh, this is a good... Oh, God. Oh, okay. We're good now. I thought you were just going to make it completely dark again. And then I would have had to actually run away from something. Where am I going? That's the question. <laughs> I'm more interested on where I'm leading, where it's, this is leading me to. You, you're king, right? <laughs> okay. Man, it just wants to scare you in every turn. What? That's very strange. Huh. Go through one elevator, get to the next one. Do I have to? Do I have to go to every light? That's creepy. I don't know if you heard that, but that was very creepy. Okay, that lights off. Now we go to this one. Are they in order? You have to get them turned off in order. Okay, next area. Okay. 
Where am I now? <laughs> Looks like a little, a little community here. The invisible community. What we got over here? A gnome inside of a house, inside of a home. <laughs> we got a gnome in a home. What's this? Are you offering me milk? Thank you. Thank you, sir. I appreciate your milk. So I know you guys heard Elf on a Shelf. Have you ever heard of Gnome in a Home? He didn't have nothing. Okay, what the hell? through here first I just want to see what's over here it's gonna be a big waste of time but you don't know until you do it oh look VC okay was that some kind of like Easter egg or something I don't know. Uh, am I about to get chased by the creature? Okay. This message is broadcasted to raise awareness of a new drug in circulation. The Snile drug. We advise for you to stay away from any person suspected to be under its influence. For the past few months, we have received over 500 deaths related to the drug. The drug itself has not been scientifically investigated. Its most obvious effects are mania, uncontrollable laughter, violent tendencies, and the latched snile in which the drug was named after. Um. To ensure your safety outside, avoid dark alleys since most reported deaths happened near or in the dark alley. If you hear suspicious laughter, run as fast as you can. Avoid eye contact with the person. Once the person notices you, it will begin pursuit. Do not interact. You will most likely be. I will most likely be terminated by the Terminator who laughs constantly. Cool. Good to know. Glad that that could be happening. I'm going to be terrified. Whatever you do, don't chase me and laugh. That's so weird. This is so weird, man. Do you see that? Are you peeking your head? <gasps> it's a balloon. Okay. 
You scared me there. I thought that was a head. Ah! Well, I'm not going down the red alley. That's that's a bad alley. Well, I guess I can't. I have to go down the red alley. No. Lost. You may be lost. I got to make things dark. We can go up the slide. To you too. Okay, things are getting a little spooky. Dude, just I don't know why that scared me. I honestly don't know why. It's just a balloon. It's not a monster. It's not out to hurt you. This is so weird. Like, who creates these rooms? Was a child creating these rooms? Got just a random tricycle in the corner. Now, what else? Are you about to do that thing where you spin? No. That would have been cool. fun why am I just walking okay that was weird all right my key got stuck <laughs> I'm just waiting for something to happen. Something's gonna happen here in a minute. I feel, I feel it. Uh, or not. Okay, what the fuck is that?
What the hell is that? Okay. Continue. Oh, maybe it's to be continued. 1985. Found in 2035. Josh was not found yet. Okay. Well, um, well, that was the back rooms. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for hanging out. It was a little bit, pretty good amount of absolutely nothing <laughs> just a good old walking around pretty spooky atmosphere um, I'm gonna look up those codes I think there's another code I could put in there's two different codes I'm pretty sure I put in a safe code which meant that the, the enemy did not come out and I think there's another code you can find that the enemy does come out so, I don't know. I'm not sure. But it was it was okay. It wasn't the greatest backrooms game. But it was fine nonetheless. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to smash that like button. And I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.